Hello everyone, my name is Reclusive Z and we are back with more Black Myth Wukong. Let's see. Yep, got him to handle. Him to handle. Let us go back to the valley entrance so I can see the horse. So when I get... I, I think he's the cart. So when I get to him, I'll... All right, so I'm back here. He started talking a little sooner than I wanted him to. I was hoping he wasn't gonna say anything till I ended this. So I have no idea what makes him so chatty and willing to go now. I don't know if it's because I eat the bull king or uh, the red one or what. I, I don't know. All I know is we can do this now. It has lingered for you. For too long. It's yours now. My journey of life. A fleeting dream. An urge unfulfilled with my life. I repay the title. Oh, this was the horse dude. Horse go. Yep. Well, shit. The hell did he become this thing? Well, that was his whip. He always had it. All right, now I'm going to run through this until I find that metal ball thing. Maybe I can hit it and crack it open. Maybe there's something in it. I don't know. All I know is I won't be ready to move on until... Uh, I finish collecting everything I want because there's still another element card around here somewhere. So I'll be back. So I'm rerunning the entire map looking for that metal ball right now and anything I've missed. Leveling as I go and uh, yeah, where I was the cicada and we fought the water dude and I had the uh, issue last episode where uh, yeah, my blast cannon mode was turned off. There's a meditation spot here. Stumbled right over it. I pass it entirely. Alrighty, and I'm gonna keep on until I find something else of interest, so I'll be back. I found something of interest immediately. I missed two things in this area. Slumbering beetle husk drinks and soaps. I'll have to check that when I get a chance to brew. Alright, so that didn't take too long. It turns out the metal ball fell near uh, where we fought the water dude. So, see what it wants, what it has. Top takes bottom, bottom takes top. Spirits. What? Oh, that's a heavy. Nope, not doing that. All right. Well, time to continue on until I uh, find more. At least this map is smaller than the other one, so it's easier to rerun. I've retalked a bull guy. He has the. Uh, same dialogue he had before, so. Nothing has changed there. All right, I'm way back up at the top of the mountain. Bull King used to be over there. He's gone. I can only assume because the chapter ended. There has to be something else up here. Something I've missed while running from that ball bearing. Well, this is... I don't remember... I don't remember seeing that. 
I may have completely and utterly glossed over Yeah, because this is where uh, the red boy playing as his sister shows up and then we run that way. So what is back this way? I don't know if this opened up afterwards or not. I don't remember seeing this path. There's a flint golem down here, I think. Ooh, and there's an upgrade tree. Yep, that's a... Jesus. He was not the one I was paying attention to. Thank you. I'll take these. This guy will reassemble himself. I was expecting him to reassemble himself. Oh, there we go. Flint Vanguard. Okay, no damage to him. Got it. Oh, he's got the same move set as, uh, Okay. This is gonna just steamroll me. Okay. I swear to God, the boss fights I survive and then immediately nuke me out of existence is just... It's wild. All right, so we're back here. And I see something over there that looks like a shrine rising in the distance, like, um, well, also like the wisps of one of the, uh, the resurrection shrines. This is a hell of a jog to get back here each and every friggin' time, so I'm gonna try and sneak pa Sneak past the vanguard real quick. So that I can maybe get to that shrine and save myself some time. And then I will uh, come back for the vanguard because yeah, it's, it's a hell of a trek to get back here. And I'm notorious for dying to really dumb, really simple bosses. So I might as well have another shrine nearby. Gotta be one around here somewhere. Of course, this seems like it's ah uh, yeah nope. But this is gonna be a hell of a trek, anyways. Don't really need any more of those. Fire macaque? The hell are you? Dead. Dead is what you are. Well, maybe sort of dead. Find gold thread. Find core. Aha, shrine. 
And then I'll go back and take on the Vanguard. And then I'll come back here and do whatever this is. There's a shrine, that means there's a boss. Another boss. A boss to the mini boss. Oh yeah, I forgot. I bought a, I did go through, I went during that pause period, I went back to the um, player hub and bought out the store and stuff. Ebriation in Paris, huh? That's right, I wanted to buy out the store. So what am I gonna do with all this money? Absolutely nothing. All right, let us go and fight the uh, the Vanguard. Fascinatingly enough, it's a trek no matter which direction you go. So I'm just gonna try and eliminate most of his... Yeah, like the cannon fodder that showed up to help him. I don't need 90% of it showing up. No, but that's just a normal rock. I think that's all the cannon fodder. I'm gonna hate to have to do it more and more often, but since that's done, I'm gonna lightly buff. Yes, because I'm getting tired of losing to really, really dumb bosses. Because I should be better than this and I'm not. Mm, that could be fun. Critical hit chance, right? Not uh damage and that one heal preemptively heal again as I am gonna have to take out that damn secondary now that he's out fire crystal, huh? How high is my crit chance right in it? Never mind, it went off. All right, and back down to uh, Flint Vanguard. Back down to that other area. Yes, I used a talisman to teleport back to this location. It's faster. I forgot they exist. All right, so this is uh, should be entertaining. I missed. I missed like a damn door. Oh shit. Oh, beep. Wow. Oh, this is something else right off the bat.
something else. Kinda did some damage. Hey, Bull did you still alive? Flame orb. Burn resistance. Well, now I feel bad for chuckling, and we're never and never wiser words were spoken. We're, nah. Stay true. All right, where does this lead me then? The amount of damage we inadvertently take that doesn't kill us, like having rocks fall on us, is amazing. Ooh, suddenly daylight. All right, so where the hell am I now? There's a shrine over there. Fire Toad! Well, I'm gonna go get... Damn it, game. For his recognition, I give my life for him. Achievement. I thought there was a sh save shrine around here. That's what I was aiming for. I was going to save and then go fight the toad. 
Ugh. All right. Oh, I'm out of berserk mode. You surprised me, Bacon. This is the Bushi Cave, huh? Two for one. Ah, I love it when it works out. the formula for that do i yeah there's a shrine i was looking for i'll complete this and then i'll go back out and fight the damn fire toad instantly resets cooldown for all spells well too bad i don't use spells right now what I am going to do is lock back in. There, so I got, looks like both directions should lead to that. Nope, meditation spot. The most marvelous places for meditation have all met your gaze. Oh, I found them all. You know what no as much as it pains me i'm gonna go fight that fire toad first just in case this ends up being one of them things that locks off this entire cave you know kind of like going to the purple mountains and realizing there's an entire boss fight that i missed because i accidentally stumbled upon the main boss because i'm curious i'll be back all right fire belly toad it's down to just you and me See what you got. Monkey see, monkey do, monkey flatten toad for you. All right, now I'm gonna go back to the other zone. I'll be back. All right, we're back in the Bushi cave. What possible boss fight could this offer us, I wonder? There's one thing this game is not short on, it is bosses. So, so many bosses.
something of a need. Are you still in the haze of what, you wicked lad? Mm. Our Lady Arthur, to guard this place, not to check another face. Kill whoever breaks in was the order. Why your word? <laughs> Oh no, it's another Tweedledee, Dweedle Dip shit. Six valiant captains who only Just fight in number. Right. All right. Well, that was interesting. Uh huh. How are those two dipshits never dizzy? It's just round and round. Goes around, flung them around. All right, uh, I didn't mean to drink that. I guess I'll make it count. There is something. Ah, mana, stamina. They just refuse to give me more mana. Didn't get a two for one. Oh well. Hey, another shrine. Must be another boss fight. I said something about Dolg or Durg. I should make another medicine. I just wasted one. There we go. Popped up, Captain. Oh. Oh, this is a place. Ah, 
um, that's, I'm getting locked up all of a sudden. Oddly locked up. Bull King's Iron Horn. Celestial Ribbon. This dude's on fire! A moment, please. Not that I don't want to play with you. But I want to hurt you. So, uh, he wasn't nearly as bad as I thought he'd be. Might have overkilled it a bit. Old governor. Wow, 44%, 181, 218. Almost got a 50% crit. This game gets more and more expansive every time. I I think I'm coming to the end and I'm not. I don't know why I'm collecting the will. A hoarder in me. I do like treasure. Okay, so there's that direction and there's this direction. I see a treasure chest. I'm afraid to caught up in an animation. There's a cliff here, which makes me think that that's the proper way to go. So what is this direction? Is there's loot here. Oh, so this is just a... This is a no-go way. Oh, okay. Get eaten by a mimic or celestial ribbon, so I'll be able to upgrade more of my equipment. Well, that way doesn't look to be the way to go, and this is going to be a power slide all the way down. really letting me steer okay another one as I'll make another set all right stock back up time to go boss fights await Crap. 
Oh, nothing about like being railroaded immediately. Yeah, I see you down there. I got something for your punk ass. You give me a minute. I keep dying to the dumbest bosses. than the red guy. You're way harder than the uh, the other two idiots. set. Okay, that missed in its entirety. Whoa. Okay, last swig. That's gonna take a few tries. way harder than the other ones. Well, this is the cycle with these bosses. Might have to pull all my points and put them into the spells. Treat this guy like, um... Holding long. Is uh it's a little ridiculous.
I'm out of potions right at the end again. Oi. Greatest fucking boss fights ever. Rakshasi, your husband shirks a dishonor this way. He granted you this cave with his Mount Bishwe beast as its sentinel. He's compromised enough for the sake of our master. You will seal your lips on this. Our family would be doomed if anyone knew the truth behind this child. Fear not. Master bids me aid you in secret. You and the bull. You will rear this child to manhood. And when the boy comes of age, well, on that day, he will be living proof of the dark deeds of Mount Lingshan. Feel as if that might have been uh, <clears throat> integral to the story that I did earlier. Bushi Beast Bit. Basket of Fire and Water. Burn inflicting, chill inflicting transformations. Yeah, neat. Alright, so what did I unlock? Oops. Ooh. Bushi Beast. Hello. Well, that's almost as dangerous as the Golden Long Staff, but I keep my crit. Well, I know what I'm making. Alright, let's make my material or my new weapon. Let's see if there's a new armor. There is new armor. Ooh. Taking damage. This one is under the effect of tenacity, grants more focus. Moderate defense disables perfect dodge, but grants tenacity when health is below half. That is a lot of armor. Well, new boots it is. Wow, these are mythical grade. New boots. Using one of these to increase my crit. The body armor on its own. Kind of a weird concept, but I'd rather have the armor over the uh, face mask.
Now oh, there. And then I'll keep my uh, damaging one. So now I've got the greaves, which do a lot of upping. The arm guards, which still increasing my crit hit. And now a good chest piece. Plenty of defense now. And um, I wonder if they've done anything with the Great Pagoda. As I have made it up to the next chapter. Pagoda Realm. Greater Pagoda. Because I don't know if they've done anything with this yet. It's here. Yeah, it's been collecting murals. And they did say somebody special was supposed to be in here. Okay, so I'm still missing one. So chapter one, two, three, four, five, and six. So what is seven? Is there anybody actually? Oh, there's the Buddha kid. Well, might as well do this. In his steps you've trod, from his eyes you've seen. The circle has led you back, have you gleaned any truths? <laughs> Long has an old friend waited for you. Destiny ripens. This last mural holds the key. Go forth. No one sees this myth more clearly than him. Okay, so what is any of this? I wasn't expecting this to open up until after I beat, uh, Bonds from Bygone Day still pull at the heart. I have memory. Well, maybe it's a good thing I didn't move on into chapter six and I went back through and did chapter five stuff. I guess we'll, uh, we'll see what secrets lie. Oh, jump. No, no jump. So what the hell awaits me in here then? Am I gonna have to fight, um, Pigman? Maybe the bull? Well, just in case. Oh, there's a shrine. End up shrine. Temple. I'm back in the frozen zones. So speaking of amplification, I got so distracted by the armor that, um, 90 and 10, oh yeah. Um, yeah, I almost prerequisite, not. The hell does that mean? Okay, I'm a dork, I figured it out. I had to look it up, I have to make the other staff first. I'm an idiot. And then I can make, yep, there we go. Nice stats. Yep, I'm specced out. So let's go forth and see what we find. Whatever it is, it'll probably kill me a few dozen times. Um, the hell was that? Shame, I must greet you in this bitter cold without a hearty drink. 
You're from the beginning. It's no easy feat getting here. I know you didn't come to keep me company. In your heart, there must be something you can't get over. Or someone you can't let go of. Same goes for me. I can't kill that monkey. No one can. Except himself. But at last, I see. This is the only way. He had no choice. And neither did I. Okay. I was just wondering. <laughs> <laughs> Damn, even with all the damage I do. I am not scratching him. Oh, this is only going to get worse. This might be one of those bosses where I have to fully spec into the old way. set. Myself get caught in it. When he was dragged to the execution yard, sword and spear were dull, cleaver and cudgel crumbled, and yet Ouch. he left once. He gave his life to put you in this place. 
Let me see you in part divergence from his. <laughs> My skin and I am my heart. Through the air, like a falling star. A little excessive. What came before? Think of it as last life's end. What comes here after? This life's stuff. Young monkey, show me how far you can go! Yeah, not far enough. Move sets upon move sets upon move sets upon move sets. Okay. Doing plenty of damage. Just, uh, as, as much fun as this is going to be, I'm going to need to swap over. So hold, please. Speaking of bosses, I should probably figure out how to beat while I'm power leveling. Let's run a couple of test phases, shall we? Nah, just stuck that right in my head, did I? Oh, so now I can transform into him. That's neat. All right, what else happened? Doesn't look like anything else changed. All right, so he op offers the option now for more curios. He was clad in splendor, yet you are plain as dirt. It's wise to wear more curios to guard yourself. I'll lend a hand. Oh, so I got to challenge him again, I see. Okay. Edge sharpened.
this guy out yet. So what now? What's fair to the eye may prove foul to handle. <laughs> okay. Did I get a curio? Oh, I did. How many times can I challenge him to get more curio slots? Can't help you when you're dead out there. I challenge him as often as I want. Well, I'm gonna run no a few tests. Nope, third curio is it, so I'll call that there for that one. Move on. Alright, let's go play with this idiot, see what happens. Nope, didn't miss that one. Impaled. So many ghosts haunt the path of triumph. Somehow she give these a try. I saw it 
sky. Swifter than shooting star. Hey, I got one of those too. Clouds drift on. Barriers about. Try this. Okay, that's not helping me at all. No nope. strike. to get him on the ground which there's no way to recharge mana all right so i'm just gonna say it i am unable to beat this boss so i'm gonna have to hope that after chapter six i can come back because otherwise i don't uh yeah i got nothing for this let's go to mount huago maybe i'm actually supposed to beat chapter six in order to tank him i don't know uh, I'm I'm gonna try and beat this chapter and then I'll see what happens. Maybe whatever boss is at the end of this will be easier than uh, what's his name? luck it's a dead end you nasty slanderer i let you be and now you have the gall to show up if you come at me now this day will be your last I just cannot get the Oh, I cannot get his timing down Okay, that's neat. Okay, that's that's real neat. I've lost my pig somewhere.
none of this shit again. Oh, cool. Still caught him. He's landed on me twice. Or, or don't cast that, you know. you but this savvy one's already on it <laughs> it must have been hidden here amongst the mist until it sensed the relics on you thanks to them it recalled its master and saved your skin now that it answers to your call why not make good use of it <laughs> your mortal body is too heavy for me in my wind form <laughs> Henchmen of the court, what draws them to this mountain? Let's find out! No, ready. G. I've got the flying Nimbus now. This is pretty neat. What is down here? Doesn't look like anything is down here. That's certainly faster to travel this way. seem like there's too much going on within this zone let's do what I do best and explore This island is feeling oddly empty. Okay, so how much of this can I actually explore? I find something interesting. I'll be back. Okay, well, that's that's an odd thing I just saw. It's a big ass cricket. Oh, well, I'm gonna go see that because as far as I can tell, there's nothing on the mainland. Oh, he jumped from over there to here. 
I, um... I don't know what this is about. Fangtail General. Oh, well, I'm not interested in fighting him just yet. As, uh... Yeah, as much fun as that's gonna be. Ain't any worse than Favon. So I can only assume he's continuously just hopping around the map. What I should do is get my, uh, Get the last cannoning again, and then just explore around. All right, so the start's behind us, and we're gonna go left and avoid the cricket right now, cause I don't wanna fight that. I don't know what that green thing is over there, but it's clapping. And we're gonna take a look at, uh, yeah, this golem. Oh, I took damage from that, great. Just remember to keep my landings close. down so that didn't leave me a spirit but a mine core um there's something out there in the water let's go see that and an oddly gold tree There's a shrine out here. Which usually means there's a problem out here. Oh, this one didn't light up or do anything. I wonder what is out here. something in the water there's some things in the water hippos are in the water stone pose I missed. There's a turtle. Since most likely that thing landing on me would somehow hurt me. That's a twisted, gnarly looking tree. Yeah, 
Yeah, you do your thing, Cricky. A big ass map. I think this might be the biggest one. Now I can't target lock these. Um, hmm. Doesn't seem like there's anything going on out here. Neat mechanic though. Thank you. Ominous. Well, one of the long scales work. As I was like general turtle. Well, I didn't mean to slip off, but all right. Oh, there's fire in there, so there's something in here. Just not able to run and jump that gap. Maybe I gotta... Oh, I'm gonna leave this alone for now. It'll probably unlock in the story. I feel like we're at the point where if I don't continue on with the story, I'm just gonna be... Uh... Getting nothing accomplished, so let's go fight the cricket. See if we can fight the cricket. Or talk to that green guy. This region looks like it'll hold something. What the hell is this? I hear something. This is a big ass rock. Um. Yeah, I can't do anything with that. As far as I can tell. Was it because I flew in? Should I have knocked first? Well, this will be to figure out later. A 
Hold, please. All right, so just outside that big mountain thing back there inside that cave is uh, whoever this is. Or whatever this is. Seems happy enough. Can I target you? Yes, yes I can. Oh, son of stone. Stone. So what is there going to be a sister of stone somewhere? Yeah, the other levels definitely felt a lot more fluid. I mean, granted, they were linear. This one's far more explorable, but... This one seems to feel equal parts empty. Or more than empty. Ooh, what's down there? Probably another one of these guys. A hey, uh, poison. Our chief. the poison. It's all nice looking over there. So what's over here? Lang Baba. Oh. Oh, this is... Am I helping the frog? I can't tell. No, 
I'm probably killing the frog, but He throws rocks Nice shotgun Okay, this frog is not the same as the others. Nope. Oh, I'm gonna be doing this fight. I can't possibly be the only one struggling with this game in certain areas, right? Like just really odd bosses that just crank the difficulty. I have no idea how the fuck I'm supposed to break that. One dodge. Two dodge. No dodge. Whoops, I forgot to unpause. Okay, so that's like Buddhist palm. So that got through. It's 
So he can just channel those rocks. has to break at some point. Storm finally broke. The hell that I'll take it. <sighs> what the hell is even going on anymore? Ignore the enemy's four Bane resistances. Yeah, if, uh, you know, I must be missing a huge chunk of this game considering I don't have any of those, like, uh, attacks. So there's, there's all sorts of stuff in here. I've got stuff for poison and... Poison seems to be the biggest one. And lightning, maybe. But I have yet to pick up any branch of an elemental type, except for that one thunder staff. If I find something else of interest, I'll be back, or when I get ready to fight the cricket. So I'm re-exploring. This is back in the uh, the fire zone. This is where uh, I took on those two big guards. Turns out there's a wine worm in here and this guy, whatever that is. What you got to say? What comfort does this heart implore? A humble drink, its solace I adore. A fine brew deserves a fitting gourd. Here, take this. The bull king accepted his destiny, but there are others who refuse to do the same. Family strife confounds even the wisest. Why should we meddle? With the full gourd's draft by my side, let cares drift away into the tide. The bull king accepted his destiny. Family strife confounds even the with a full gourd. Well, supposedly he gave me a gourd. Family strife with a full gourd drop. Doesn't seem like it. Yeah, nope. That's what he meant by give him, giving me a gourd. Oh, it's got 10 uses. Well, that's a lot more than... Um, yeah, because that's my current gourd. Seven uses, but now I got... I guess I'll just have to learn how to deal with that again. All right, but that's how you get the Supreme Gourd. I was like, he said he offered me a gourd, and I was looking around, I'm like, I don't see one. I was like, ah, probably the fire thing. It was a brain-dead moment on my part. Alrighty, everyone, I've decided for my own sanity and peace of mind that I am going to call it quits for now. I need time to think, research, and uh, study my own build better. I was thinking of going into the pillar stance for the range, but I think I, I've i got to test it. I don't know how it works in comparison to uh, just the smash stance. I know I can't move in this one, and I'm basically planted in place until I stab something. 
So, uh, yeah, I'm going to have to do some research and make some adjustments and do a bunch of other things and see if I'm pretty sure everything in here just affects transformations. It doesn't affect anything else. Um, <clears throat> I added the Supreme Gourd to my uh, arsenal and I've got each sip up to 50% health recovery. It's almost maxed. I added the Bee Mountain Stone, Purple Veined Peach Patch for more crit or for more uh, healing at critical health. And, um, well, I've kept the iron pellets because it can't be interrupted if I'm attacked and it provides damage reduction. Hello, everyone. So I'm in the process of editing up a video and I've realized that video is not going to be long enough. It's only going to be about an hour and 40 minutes ish when normally my videos push to two and a half. So I am going to splice this video in right here at the end. Um, this is my last attempt at fighting Erlang Shen. This is just after I've come home. I've been throwing attempt after attempt after attempt at him. I've been mixing in potions and tactics and different fighting styles. I've just been throwing everything possible at him and hoping something eventually hits him. Um, and that's about all I've got for it. I've had my mic muted for this entire length right up till the very end because I've been recording every encounter with him and they've all ended in failure up until this point. So I hope you all enjoy my, uh, <laughs> I hope you all enjoy me finally getting a victory over him and uh, I'll be back uh, at the end of the fight during the cutscenes where hopefully I didn't blow out my mic when I, uh, oh, when I shouted for joy. Enjoy the video. My spirits, monkey. When he was dragged to the execution yard, sword and spear were dull, cleaver and cudgel. Crumbled, and yet he emerged unscathed. It gave his life to put you in this place. <laughs> Let me see your path, divergence. 
Rush the moon and winds drive. The clouds. It's too late. No more spells. Step forward. You too. You made it this far. Now, show me. Your destiny brought you here. Today's clash didn't satisfy my spirit. No, oh, that's over. Sky. Let us get drunk before we continue this. Oh, it's over. No, no, it's not over. Never mind.
Okay, let's, um, okay, I seem to be healing somewhat. This is a little excessive. I keep swapping my targets. Get knuckled. I'm so on friggin' edge.
my heart's trying to escape my chest. God, I hope I don't have to redo all of this if I die somehow. Not excited, most of those aren't connected. It's a little broken bossy. Oh, that hurt. Let's go with this. He's connected. cheating.
keep the sustainability up. This ain't good. Never mind, I'll take it. crap we call a bro bitch slap I 
I hear tell this Yaogua is I rank a thousandfold above that king. As his sire, he reveres me, and like a deity, he serves me. How dare you think I'm time. his slave? Kindly chant the loosening spell and release that, Tathagata, so that you can take back my head. Only your friend can be free of the corpse of Yaogua. But said he knew the sword. Surely he is no mere mortal. You must be somebody from the court. Great. The journey ends here. The eyes wide to bring open. Them. Watch me rip it off. And break free. Tested you at my behest. Oh, for this day. And only now do I understand that fight. No prestige can shackle him. No band can keep him caged. A mortal death for an unbound mind and will. May you not. I'm now at peace. Your journey, though, has just begun. Say, what's to come of destiny if he steps out of that mural? <laughs> I make a living by reading what was written. The signs alone tell what's to come. What's to come is what's not yet written. No one can read what's not written. Destiny is written in what's done. What's done shapes what's to come, not escape. <laughs> it's all written for me, if only I uncover all that occurred. So? Hmm? There really is something even you cannot read. <laughs> That's good. Very good. <laughs> Between the boundless dome and the mortal plains, this lone monkey stands, unyielding and unsustained. Unstained, boy. Transform into stone monkey, gain immunity to shock and poison, absorb and convert frost and scorched, empower yourself, retain access to the destined one's spells, and convert any pre-transformation focus for use afterwards. Hello everyone, my name is Reclusive Z, and um, that is the end of the uh, the secret boss and the secret ending, I guess. Now I'm ready to go complete chapter uh, six. Yeah, I have no idea how I did any of that. I did a lot of frigging researching and watching and studying and learning and just trying to get my own counter strategy running and just so many videos, so many hours, so many just straight up attempts at that all ending in failure or being so close to passing and then failing that it drove me to the brink of insanity. And then I finally did it. I finally beat him. Take that, you asshole. 
I am unbound, unshackled. Now I've got to go do whatever remains in chapter six. Oh man, my heart was threatening to jump out of my chest that entire fight because I didn't know if I was going to have to go all the way back to beat up shield douche. Game science. Whichever one of you thought it was a good idea to give an enemy an almost 100% damage negating regenerating shield. You're evil. You are evil beyond any and all human comprehension. And that was some Dark Souls level bullshit. At least I think it was, considering, you know, as I've said in the beginning, I've never played a Dark Souls game. This is the first thing I played with any kind of resemblance or likeness to a Souls game. So if that's what I've got to look forward to in the Souls, Dark Souls or Elden Ring or even Sekiro, I may stay away just for my own sanity, but God, the challenge is thrilling. I don't know. I'll have to think on it after um, I take on chapter six and uh, then take uh, finish off this game and then start Space Marine 2 and then move on to um, Stalker 2. But man, holy crap. I don't know if I'm supposed to beat him during New Game Plus or what, but I feel pretty good doing it first. You know, first time, you know, without a New Game Plus. Holy crap, okay, what's the spear do? Oh, Crucial Thrust shoots swords from the staff to attack. Oh, that sounds, sounds like so much fun to play with. I give up a little bit of crit chance, but I gain so much damage and I get to play with something new. Oh, it's crafted already. Wait, is it? Yes, it is. So it'll at least give me a reason to go into um, the thrusting tree, finally. But yeah, it turns out um, most of... I, I couldn't use Spellbinder. I got very close several times with Spellbinder, but it was just... spell dry, Spellbinder was driving me loony at that point. Most of my build is normal. I thought I could use this at some point. Ended up not using it. Um... None of this really changed in here. What did change is um, the fact that I actually put Cloud Step to use, which I may spec back into this later. And uh, Pluck of Many, as you can see, you'll probably see in the video. All right, now I'm going to go back into what uh, I've been enjoying, which is Spellbinder. And, um, I'm going to muck around in chapter six for a while. I'm going to go beat up that, um, cricket and, oh, 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 yeah. I did go around during my power leveling and finding things to take on Erlang. I, um, found the other Skanda, Skanda, whatever, um, whatever these are. I don't know where these are used, but if I had a feeling, it's probably near that big ass mountain in chapter six. So I will uh, probably end up going that way. So until then, so thank you everyone for watching. I hope you've enjoyed my antics. And if you like my content, feel free to like, subscribe and share out my videos. It will help me gain a better understanding of my community and the videos I make. So until then, I will see you all in the next video. Bye.